Do you guys want a clean chat overlay to look like this? Let me show you how to do that. Before we get into the video guys, let me just say my name is Taikai, I'm a variety streamer and I stream every Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday at 7pm Central European time over on Twitch. Come check out the channel and if you have any questions related to content creation or anything like that, my DMs are open anytime to answer you. Let me show you how to get this clean chat overlay with the user icons with it. So the first thing you guys are going to want to do is head over to pixelchat.tv and here you'll have the home page uh, for pixel chat over here uh, you can see uh i have an active overlay which is the pixel chat but i'm going to show you how to make a new one as well so go over here to overlays you want to go up here to create new overlay and you want to select chat over here and you'll see that it will create another one here i have two because i already have one on my obs but i'm going to show you how to do it completely from scratch so once you get this uh, over here, you're going to have to go into edit and edit it however you wish. So for example, we have animation here. Uh, I choose not to fade out my messages. I kind of like them uh, to stay there uh, for all time. Uh, message fade out time. I like to keep it at seven animation fade in, fade out. It's good. The style. I like to show the user icons there's just something unique about it and this is mainly the reason why i believe this chat is um superior than all the other uh, chat bots or chat functions that you see out there what i like to do here is remove this message background and like to completely make this transparent to have only the chat showing uh we can make the font anything you wish um, as long as it's uh installed into your computer i usually choose a monster rat gives a a nice font there I, I like this uh more than anything really you can make the chat box corner rounding if you enable this and you can just play around uh with the settings once you get everything the way you like it for me this is okay so what i like to do afterwards is then go straight back and it usually just saves it like that then you just want to copy the link and let's head over to obs Okay, so now we're in OBS. I left my camera here and I left display capture open so you can see what I'm doing. Let's add the chat overlay now. So what I'll do now is go to the plus down here. Go to browser, name it whatever you wish. And just replace the URL with the URL that you copied. Just paste it there, click OK, and it should be there. To test this out, you could go on your Twitch channel like I am on now and just start <laughs> doing this and as you can see we'll add a few commands over here but another one feel the burn and there you go now you can see my icon over here along with the twitch chat what i like to do is give it a little more a little more like pizzazz you know so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to add a source mirror over here uh name it whatever you want and i'm gonna mirror my camera again so where's my camera there we go so we'll do that and we'll just push this over here like that we have the source mirror now then what i'm gonna do on my source mirror let me get display capture so once you have your the source mirror the second one you can go into filter like this okay we're gonna add a blur effect and the type that we're going to be using is dual filtering. This doesn't take so much uh, CPU usage uh, like Gaussian blur does. And we'll leave it at five. That looks good. Okay. I'll remove display capture again. And now we have this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press alt on my keyboard and I'm going to move this over like this. My apologies. This needs to be full size like that and as you can see now we have a blur effect over here i like to keep mine roughly this size and then what we can do is with the chat where is the properties 
we can start shaping it to that uh to the blurriness over there so let's say what is this 400 by i'm just guessing here 900 that's a lot better much better so so there you go guys that's how to get a clean looking overlay i mean you can mess around with this some more make it fit perfectly and then you will have a clean looking setup like my just chatting screen on uh, twitch which is this and there you go you can add a display capture down here and and show off uh, whatever you're doing and have the chat here with the user icons there i hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to check out my twitch channel and my discord if you have any questions links will be in the uh, description below have a great day and i'll see you on twitch <laughs>